That's right. Mr. Hoffa's visit to Toledo was his fourth trip to Ohio related to issue two. He says polls show the race for issue two is narrowing, and he hopes his visit can spark the campaign. My friends here in Ohio told me what Governor Kasich said when he took over. I understand that he said, get on the bus or I'm going to run you over. Well, Governor Kasich, we got a big truck out there, and now we're going to run you over. A lot of initiatives going on across the country, and this is one of those battles right now. This is part of the war on workers uh, that started at the beginning of this year. Issue 2 is facing a citizen's veto during the November election. Opponents say it's a bill that would take away collective bargaining rights from public workers. At a time poll support is dropping to some, Hoppe's visit is a much-needed spark. It's awesome to see that uh, the movement, we the people, are, are, are getting involved again. And it, it seems like a, a spark of new energy. And to see somebody from that magnitude to come here is, is just, it's excellent. No two, no two, no people have always had collective bargaining. Collective bargaining is basically instrumental. It's almost, you know, part of the First Amendment of the institution. You should have that right. All employees in Ohio should have that. And they've had it for years and years and years until John Kasich comes in and tries to take it away. Well, the group that supports issue two, Building a Better Ohio, did not comment on tonight's rally specifically. But supporters have said the issue is a way for cities to control workers' costs, giving them a way to balance their budgets. Reporting tonight, Jennifer Steck, Fox Toledo News.